Hello everyone and welcome back to my let's play of Labyrinth. We're gonna finish up and use this floor since this is what we're thinking for the wheel, so I guess my floor. And we're gonna do the left one. Hopefully this goes well. I hopefully I think we'll be okay. L5123 fourth door. 14 steps to the right. 23 steps to the left. This is staircase. How far down does this go? The sound is getting louder and I see a dim light. Is it really okay to head inside? I guess I have no choice. What's this? Where are these huge machinations supposed to be? Welcome, welcome. It must have been an exhausting journey. Come in, come in and make yourself at home. Who are you? I'm the weaver working here. It's so nice to see a guest after such a long time. Come on now. Don't be shy and step right in. A weaver? Yep, that's what I am. You were invited by the prescript, right? How did you... The likes of you couldn't even dream of finding this place without the guidance of the prescript. It only invites people here on a very extraordinary occasion, so consider yourself honored. Does this place have something to do with the prescripts? Yes, oh yes, it has plenty to do with them. This is the birthplace of prescripts. Prescripts are born? Your face tells me that you must have a lot you like to hear. And that's good. I was really bored. Too, actually. You should take a seat first. Here. This will be a long story. Here's your share. Hmm, I wonder if these are the shares. I'm not really sure what this is. Sorry. I have no tea. It's hard to come by warm weather down here. Oh, where are my manners? What's your name? Are you a proxy or a messenger? My name's Moira. H hold on. Could you please hold down? First off, I'm Jan. Jan Bismarck. I'm a messenger. I started working less than a month ago. Jan? So you were a messenger? Yes, I've been delivering prescripts full of the cerebral orders. Oh, I understand. Prescripts are cruel indeed, and naughty too, which some people get killed. I had to hear me resentful remarks and screenshot from the people who received their prescripts. Are you... are you the one who wrote those ridiculous prescripts? Jeez, so scary. Don't scowl at me, so dreadfully now. To answer your question, first... No, I am not responsible for the contents of the prescripts. My occupation is to manage these spinning wheels and loom. Huh? Then how are prescripts born? Can you hear the sound? Can you feel the tremor? Climbing up your feet and touching your bosom? I can feel a tiny quake, yes, but... What about it? It's just a small vibration. Wrong! This isn't a tre simple tremor. You're feeling the heartbeat of the city. It vibrates at random frequencies. Those vibrations move the pendulum over here and I spin the wheel to make threads. Please make like a billion, I need them for my Olympus uptight upgrades. Oh why, hear me describe it when you can see it in action. Here why don't you come closer and take a look. A new prescription is about to be born. The pendulum swings above the tread. I spin the inscribing meaning on them. Meaning, all of these are random patterns. It could seem hazy at first. This is the language of the city, after all. You obviously won't recognize it. Oh no, no. The language of the city. Were there more languages left to be found? I think I think what language you speak in the city. Is there only one language? Huh. Hmm. It's a different kind of language people use. Oh, it certainly is. The thing is, I have no idea what it means either. I will soon be able to find out. There are 57 spinning wheels here. 
The dreads spawn from those wheels are then put into this loom, and I mostly weave the cloth from them. Wait just a moment now. And there it is. Look, a prescript's been created. No way. To Xiao Han. You see a person on a three waist intersection, waving their hands seven times. Follow them to their house. It really is a prescript. Alright, no time to be spacing out. We should send this prescript to a mess messenger for delivery, right? Start with this stamp. And let's see, let's see. The code is N N. It's next to L N nine two zero N one. So I guess this takes it to N corp baby. Uh, so there it is. Pipe number N nine two zero one is right here. Now we roll out this prescript and put it in here. The prescript will travel along the pipe all the way to the surface. That's what prescript were? This can't be. Who made the spinning wheel, the loom, and the pipes? Then... I have no clue. I was led here by prescript too. Oh. Oh, my prescriptor desert was waiting for me when I arrived that day. Left res after receiving a prescript one day. Have you never questioned the prescripts? N not really. I don't have much else to do anyway. Do you have an idea how many people died because of your stupid randomly generated command? That'd be hilarious if it's just complete random coincidence. <laughs> if this were all the prescripts were made, then you could at least tweak them a little so they're not so cruel. I'm doing this because the prescript ordered me to create and send prescript down here though. If I broke this prescript, the prescript would get me killed. What are you talking about? You're the one in charge of sending out prescripts. What if there's another weaver like me somewhere in the, another nest? You don't possibly think I'm the only one mailing all the prescripts for the city, do you? That's where is this? Is this El Corp or is this on the Earned Corp? Someone has to be making the contents of the prescripts, but who could it be? In my opinion, that'd be the city itself. The pendulum inscribing pattern on the thread swing according to the city's motion, like I said just before. Footsteps of pedestrians walking around the surface, quakes coming from construction sites, impact crates from a clumsy person falling on the ground. Man, they must have really hit the ground really hard for to make a quake. Echoes from people's screens. Every little event happening in the city becomes a vibration to move the pendulum. Even the sound of us talking. At the end of the day, us city folk can never be free from the city. Every day committed by Tennyson of the city is ultimately the city's deed. We're representing its will in a sense. All the cruel things we've committed were of the city's volition. Why did the city have to be that way? Because the people are. The city was built by people, and their cruel nature had to naturally reflect on their creation. I don't know, I feel like this would be done before the city was mainly to get over by people since there were robots around here. This feels a lot more mechanical. We were born that way. This is a mess. People built the city and now the city is controlling the people. Didn't people build the city? Does the order really matter much? I think the point is this. That whatever we do, we're essentially part of the city. All you do is wave cloth in this place, peaceful bunker. You probably have no idea what kind of brutal outcomes a piece of cloth you make can bring. That's why you can talk about this in such a carefree attitude. You're right. That's beyond me. I only do what I was ordered to do. Do I really have to care about that though? According to the city's will, its volition, the city will match the will of the people living in it. Did you know? They are beings born of the city's folks wants. Humans want to walk the path that is given to them. They are afraid of the consequences of their actions and take responsibility for them. They know that they will only end up doing the wrong way if they try to make their own decisions. They rather rely on something and expect things from it rather than to live a life of struggle. 
people without purposes in their lives desiring and yearning for something to open up a way for them. It could be someone wishing for equality, I miss savagery, and voyeurism. Or it could be the vain hope of those who want the city to try furthermore, providing all for all of its inhabitants. That's how cats were born. People needed them. They didn't pop into existence because someone told them to. They can't be made out by anyone, nor can they be oppressed. You can't blame anyone for this. So many people, so many residents of the city want them. Thus, their fear that will draw near them. The temptation of happiness. The promise and wishes of all people. Are you starting to get it? Why the priesthood came into existence? <laughs> yeah, right. It wasn't my fault. People were doing humane things because I delivered the priesthood to them. Those horrible things were meant to happen anyway. You're right. I think I see it now. It's a city. It's because the people were always been cruel. Humans are born that way. And they have desperate wishes. It doesn't matter if they were pure wishes welled up from the innocent hearts or ambitious born from greed. This is a result of what everyone wished for. Killing people with my own hands or taking away invaluable things from others. Shouting in guilt, listening to those horrid screams, while I try my best to seem unfaced. There were all useless feelings eating away at my heart. Exactly. I'm just a tiny part of the world. I can never change the wishes of all people. There's no way I can defy this law. What I did was part of the city. The will of the city. Forging priests out of spite and delivering them could be traced to the city's solution. Not my free will. But that equates to my volition in the end. The city and I, and every person in the city, were one and the same. Do you think so too? And he distorted. It looks pretty cool though. I think. Lambo Mechanical. Mora, the city must know where I should go next. Huh? Me? Oh, don't you just for you worry. Just a moment, please. All right, here's an invitation to the library, prepared just for you. As the city will said. What was he talking to, or was he talking to me all along? Well, regardless. Back to my post. Can I keep my position? Well, she's very peppy. Color me speechless. So that's where the speakers really were? Beings akin to the cat of the city? I don't think I've heard or read any mention of such things. It does seem like there are some beings out there that fit the description that we were person gave. I think I've seen something similar a few times though. I don't know if it's actually one as one. I'm sure if being is the right word for them, to be honest. There's a plot created because people wish for them to exist. I don't know about a lot of them, to tell you the truth. According to her logic, the priesthood would be one such being created from the collective aspiration of those who want to be given a purpose in their endless lives. So, you seen one yourself, Roland? Don't know. I might have, but I only really know what I saw. Heck, I never been sure if I saw it at all. That doesn't count as seeing one, does it? It's just my memory about the details if it is blurry. And I don't feel like remembering it for whatever reason. Hmm, interesting. You don't think highly of them, huh? Seeing what one of those metaphorical gods made out of people wishes is doing, I can see them in a positive light. They seem to lead people to ruin. In one way or another, it is truly for the danger's sake. What do you think, Roland? Do you think those gods are leading the rest of the city to the correct path, as some claim? I won't lie, that at a glance they do look like a weird cult giving their lives to an object that swings on a whim. And they're giving an arbitrary meaning to it, like how it's the heartbeat of the city. That's a consequentialist point of view, shared by many other religions. The method they take may be a complete mess. That being said, I don't think that there's an absolutely nothing to say about them. They fulfill the people's wishes, anyhow. The results 
are another story. Even though the so-called gods bring fear and despair to people, they get to live the life that's richer and more human. The goal might be forcefully handed to them, but still better than nothing. Well, you're free to think whatever you want in the end. You could feel the prescripts are horrible or justify necessity or whatever. You're right. Anyways, we should put our personal impressions aside and prepare to receive our guests. I'm counting on you, as always. Receive a prescript and carry it out. Receive a prescript and carry it out. Receive. Greetings, your guest. If I may, I am Angela. Yes, it would seem that you know me well. The prescripts know everything. The prescripts represent the will of the city. They know everything that goes on in the city. They know what I'm going to do, what you are going to do, all of it. I see. Don't you have any doubts about the prescripts? Of course not. The prescripts are the city's will, and the city's volition is my will. To deny the city's volition is to deny myself. By setting that truth, you are acknowledging that you have no free will of your own. Don't you feel that is unfair? We are no longer to be driven to despair by repercussions of our choices. We don't have to be worn down from pain, standing in the field of thorns on our feet. I, you have no feet. By filling up the part that can't be achieved alone, our lives as humans can become much more lavish. I have the talent to walk the path in front of me. If nothing else, even if I don't know much of happiness, I know where to go in the immediate future, and that's enough for me. It's fortunate to hear that you are satisfied with it. May you find your book in this place. Alright, let's do this. Oof, I'm nervous. Ah, uh, dang. That's gonna be a pain. Alright. Ja oh, this music. Oh, alright, let's see. Let's get this started. Alright. Please give me good speed on everyone. Thank you. Okay, so. First things first, let's switch his stance to the slash stance. Good. Second thing. He kinda need to fight this. What do I wanna. I'm gonna get pages first, actually. Yeah, that should be fine. Oh man, this song. Yeah, I love this song. Alright. For you. I saw how slow are you? 554. That's not great. Okay, I can work with that actually. Going for me, I'll accept that. Let me just get some energy here. Let me let's see, redirect this. And redirect this one. I know. Actually, let's swap everyone first. So, concentration first for the charge, then energy cycle. It will redirect everything to me so I get all the debuffs. Then I need to make sure that I protect myself here. And unfortunately, it does look like I am not that fast. Alright, you can defend against this. Do I want to go with. Uh, I think. I'll go with this. I need to get my pages quickly. Redirect that one. Let me uh, swap that actually. I want to block that one first. And then. Attack this one. Uh, I'm gonna take a lot of damage here. Hopefully, you'll be okay. Alright, I guess this person's free to do what they want. Let's see. They do have basically anything they can do here, so that's at least good. Who is weak to. What do I have? Also, a plant. Plant. Okay, they're both weak to plant. I'll just take one of them. 
this one. All right, let's go. That's fine. I just need to get my charge. Oh, wow. Aw. Oh, you did pretty good there. That's okay. Come on, come on. Okay. Oh, no. Rio doesn't have enough. That sucks. I'll work with it. Oh. Perfect. They also have the mark. Okay, that should make things convenient a bit later on. All right, and everyone has some charge. All right, let's see who are you gonna give the gift to. That works for me. Ah, oh, dang it, I don't have any. Okay, that could be a problem. I guess I'll use redirect this and redirect this. All right, go. Now everyone else needs to actually help out here. Okay, that's good. Seven is going to this one. I can work with that. That one's some smoke. I don't think. Actually, I'll do that one last. Let's see. Oh, I'm the slowest here. That's not good. That's fine. I'll just pierce eye, pierce eye, plant this guy on this one. So I'm gonna attack the top one here. Do they both or this pierce? Yeah, they do. Hmm. I'll go with. This and then can some charge back. All right, you. Let's go. Get some more cards. And you are weak to think, but not sure if I want to you yet. How are you? Oh man, you're going for both of them, and they're both pretty hard hitting here. That's not good. Okay, let me think. Now nah, they're not gonna be able to win that, are they? I'm gonna have to like block one. I'll go with this one. I will give me some back and I'll take the top one from here. And you don't want to smoke right now. Let's go. Let's just go in. Let's go then. We take care of one of these arms and this should be way easier for me. All right, everyone get ready. Yep, let's go. Okay, good. I got some side back there. Nice. Oh no, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. It's all right. Uh oh, why didn't I defend against? Ah, it's fine. Okay, he's almost there. Uh oh, why is he taking so? No! <laughs> Alright. It's okay. Hmm, this is a tough one. I think, actually, this is not gonna do anything for them. I'll take your edge. I can fight people anyhow. Why am I so slow? Oh, man. Oh, that's not good. Nah, this is good. Alright, let's see. What am I going for here? Definitely backline. Ah, oh, he's too slow. Ah, this is when I need the speed to be actually really high. Okay. That's fine. This is fine. You need to actually win some of these. Yeah, let's go with that. You're taking your off. All right, let's see. You're my fastest one, so I need to use you to. All right, um, let's see. Would we'll use multi slash and smoke blow, I guess. All right, that's fine. You are getting attacked by that. 
I wish you guys got more speed here. I oh, think I'm not gonna do about this. I'm getting jumped by everyone. This is an ideal. Why am I so slow? Why do I have none of my oh this is just not lucky for me right now. Alright, uh block against that. So I'll get the top one first, I guess. I should fuck them evenly. Do they have any no counter die? One counter die. Following pretty top one. You are free to do whatever you want here, I guess. Let's go with this guess. And let's actually get the bad one actually. Okay, let's go. I need to get that one uh, motion card that I need to prevent a future attack in a few turns. Oh, it's a dead? Oh no, I guess it still moves even after. Oh, alright. Okay, one down. Yes. That's more like it. It's okay. We're okay. Stagger. That's tempting. Get more damage. Lower the cost. That's also very tempting. Ah, oh, man. I want the one here. How much? 280. I'll definitely get a benefit of this for sure. Sure, I think I'll be fine. Hopefully, without my style management. And then I'm trying to repair it. Good. Alright, so let's do this. You. Alright. We need to get some emotion here. Rhea and Sebastian. Alright, so. You guys are done, fine. Need to... Oh, they're too slow. Great. Thought they're not slow enough for this, so. Oh, I can get my. I think finally. Divide protections. You can redirect this one as well. Um. Rescript. And I get some light. You have no light card, so that's fine. Oh, yeah, I went for the wrong one. The attack one is the one I want to swap. Meanwhile, you do. Alright, let's see. Oh, that's not good. Hmm. I should do you first. I guess this one should be fine, I think. I kinda want to block that, but I don't really have a middle block die at the moment. Yeah, on the other hand, you should be able to win this with Mandanet. And from here, no counter dice, that's good. Oh, at least one counter dice. I'll go this to destroy it quickly. And let's go for this to get some things there. Just in case this thing does not die, we'll do apply some more pressure. Alright, that should be good. Nice, good, good, yes. Almost, no. Okay, you're not too badly hurt. Okay, that gonna suck, but that's fine. Come on, die already. Oh, please don't tell me I messed up. Okay, good. Three turns for the thing. I need you guys to get their emotion higher. Power at the pass. Increase the power. Cost. Oh, that'd be good if I... It's too late. I, I can't... Hmm. Redirect things. Increase. No, that's not helpful. Is it worth it? Okay, ah, uh, this could be a bad idea. Oh wait, uh, 
I'll take homing instinct so I can get some light over here. Oh, look at you. Defending. Oh, that's annoying. I agree, this is like you. Right, let's see. Let's go. Concentration. Oh man, these cards are not as good now. By like a lot. Alright, let's see. Let's get some smoke in. Oh wait, next turn I'm gonna use a really powerful attack, so I need to be a bit more. The idea is to not do anything this turn. Actually, let's just use our light recovery cards here. Just to play it safe for this turn. Next turn, he'll use a really big AoE attack, and I definitely do not want anyone to get hit by that. So let's see if we can get everyone's. Maybe just one more? Alright, we'll go with this. Wait, no. Yeah, we'll go with this one. You. Luckily, you have a bunch of good level 1 guards. I'll save there for next time. How many instincts just in case? Let's go. That's so many block dice. Push this arrow, if some gets stagger, that'd be really bad. Okay, good, you got powered up. That's more like it. Not doing too much damage, but I'm gonna like go out next turn. I should maybe I should gonna build harder this turn. I want everyone to get some more light. That's fine. Uh oh, AoE, here it comes. Yep. But everything else is blocked, it's fine. We will go concentration against that. Dang, I, I might have made a mistake by... Alright, that's fine. I'll have to work with that mistake. Let me do one alliteration. 5-9-5-9-5. Yeah, I need to go with this. Extra fuel. Dagger press. Ben and Fang. Let's go allow in. Hmm. This. Right. I thought that. Faint. For you, let's power everything up here. Sharp. Snake lid. And let's go all out with Mantle Net there. And then we're gonna need some light back right here. Alright, let's go. No. Dang it, something. I think someone got staggered. I don't know, that might have been really bad. Okay, come on. Get everyone do their thing. Good. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Is this? No way. Wow. I did it. Huh. You know, um... I, okay. <laughs> I was thinking that would last a lot longer. Honestly, probably the best thing to end as fast as possible because this fight, the longer it goes, the worse it gets. Could that person's death be what the prescript intended? Meets me. The prescript looked like they see several steps ahead, so it might as well be. Though, boy, what did that giant guy endure and struggle so much for? You risked death forging prescript trying to express his free will. But that was ultimately part of the prescripts. The will of the city, as he puts it. Yep. After all, the city failed those prescripts led him to. He said earlier that there are good things to be said about them, Roland. That I did, because they're still part of the city. 
But I'm still not completely convinced. I can understand that somewhat. Life as a human, never wanting for anything. Why is the reason God has really emerge? Why do people wish for them to exist, even after they suffer? I tried to think from those people's perspective. The perspective of someone without a purpose to live. How would I act in their shoes? What's your conclusion? It couldn't be more obvious. I won't say and wait for someone else to determine the meaning of my life for me like others. I'm different. I'm simply built different, literally. I'll seek a way on my own. It's much easier said than done. They won't really realize what they're talking about until they're put in such situations themselves. So they can't be viewed all that badly? Correct. I've decided against painting them in an excessively native light. That still doesn't mean I fully understand them, however. Although, I am curious about what you just mentioned as well. I must wonder what Jan's action and the consequences to them were trying to show. I haven't got a clue, ma'am. haven't got a clue. Who's to say the purpose there was to it in the first place? Those prescripts sure are an enigma. In this whole distortion business, it's scary how the process can be so simple. That demonstration made it clearer. It appears that the breakdown of a belief on friendly help can serve as a catalyst for the distortion. Exactly. That's the scariest part. It's what happened all the time in the city. Though someone did explain to me why people aren't distorting left and right pretty clearly. Either way, this left a bitter taste in my mouth. Just like that other time. Alright, I'm surprised we did it. Uh, I mean, I'm surprised we did it that quickly. Uh... Anyhow, I had a whole strat planned out. I was gonna like, aha, so you use an ego page. And I'd say you triggered my trap card emerald and just canceled it out. But I guess that didn't happen. Oh well. Anyhow, I guess we'll call it there. One more that I left and I'm not sure if I want to use the wheel or should I just go with one of the lowers. Though, I guess we'll figure it out next time. Until next time, thank you for watching and goodbye.